the other day he said I could be on the basketball team, and then he said I couldn't. And you felt that blowing up the gymnasium was an appropriate response then? Yes, I did. Would you please stop hitting the back of my chair? I am trying to sleep. I'm sorry, Miss Nice Older Person, but I don't know what you're talking about. Perhaps you were just having a nightmare about your early days in the circus. What? So will you drop this dinosaur world thing for five seconds, huh? Would you do that for me, huh? Would you? Oh, boy, you're driving me crazy. Uh-oh. Looks like Daddy's gonna have a big stroke. And then he'll be talking like that. Oh, I swear and to God. Girl. What bird? Oh, God, would you just stop it for just one minute? Whatever you say, sweet one who birthed me. Hey. <sighs> Where's my son? The last time I saw him, he was counting the money that he was given in the men's room. You pervert! Oh! Oh! Oh, my ear! You hit my ear! Tell me where he is! Hi, Clifford. How go, Martin? Have you seen Sarah? She was taken off to meet someone named Rowijni by a lady who looks like this. <laughs> what makes your face look like that, Uncle Martin? That's what they call a facelift. What's a facelift? Oh. oh. That's not child's heart. Sorry. Uncle Martin, <laughs> how was your stay in penitentiary? Did you meet any interesting hoodlums? <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. I don't believe what I'm hearing. I don't believe what I'm hearing either. <laughs> oh, honey, be careful while you eat your cereal. Use a napkin. This boy and his cereal. <laughs> And you tell Sarah that you and I are the best of friends. And we are, aren't we? Shut up. But if you even look at me funny, if you do one thing that I find weird, which is, you know, like your middle name, see, you're doing it right now. Can you just act like a human boy for one minute here? Look at me like a person. You can't do it for more than a few seconds. Look at me like a human boy. Don't mess around with me. You're such a baby. You know, Clifford should be babysitting you. Oh, no thanks. I prefer babysitters who aren't affiliated with the Manson family. What are you talking about? Where is Clifford? Oh, don't worry about Clifford. He'll be happy if you, if you give him a ton of sugar and a book about Hitler. Oh, Uncle Martin, I am so glad you're here. I got in a train to run away, but a person tried to touch my no-no special place. And then when I got back, there were bikers here, and they tied me up, Uncle Martin. And then they told me stories that they do on their bikes. Some of them were fun, but some of them were scary. You poor dear darling. Uh, Are you okay? Uh, what is he doing uh, to you? I don't know. Why don't you ask him how he got tied up like that? Tell her about the bikers and your damn no-no place. Well, there it is, Clifford. Dinosaur world. Are you happy? I say I'm the happiest boy in the whole wide world, Uncle Mental Case. I'm the Mental Case. But you're the one in the straitjacket. Yes, well, I imagine when they put you in yours, they'll need a much larger one, sir. Is that scary? That was so much fun. By the way, how many years do you think you'll get for kidnapping me, Uncle Ten Most Wanted? Life. Let's go a little faster, shall we? Yes! Come on, save me! Uncle Martin! I'm thinking it over! Please, I'm scared. Well, I'm scared of what might happen if I save you. I mean, maybe I should do mankind a tremendous favor and let that dinosaur eat you. I mean, who knows what horrors you might unleash? What if you got your hands on some plutonium? I just made the best nuclear bomb in the whole wide world. I'm sorry. No, no, Clifford, don't, don't. I, I don't want to hug you. I, I can't imagine anyone ever wanting to hug you. I really am sorry. You really are sorry? You know, sorrow is, is a human emotion. And as we know, you're not a human boy. You're just this, this destructive thing. Eventually, everyone just gets to hate you. You'd tell me if you were having a nervous breakdown, wouldn't you? <laughs> <laughs> nervous breakdown. Can you just act like a human boy for one minute here? Look at me like a person. 
You can't do it for more than a few seconds. Look at me like a human boy. The only thing worse than being a 10-year-old boy. Would you please stop hitting the back of my chair? I am trying to sleep. I'm sorry, Miss Nice Older Person, but I don't know what you're talking about. Perhaps you were just having a nightmare about your early days in the circus. Is being his uncle. You wouldn't lie to me, would you, Uncle Martin? Because if you did, I'd be so angry. I don't know what I'd do. Martin Short and Charles Grote. Careful while you eat your cereal. Use a napkin. This boy and his cereal. <laughs>